if you thought we were done, we are not. Part two. So now that you know how to do the compound, let's say you roll an even number and you flip heads. We already know it's three over six, simplified to one over two, and one over two for the coin. One over two times one over two equals one over four. But now, let's say, what's the probability of this event if this is done 60 times? What do you do? You multiply the probability times 60 times. One, four, times 60, 15 times is the probability that this event will happen. Next, probability of pulling the letters for Axel out of a bag in order. So what do you do? You have all the letters inside the bag and you're gonna pull them out in order. So, chance of A coming up first, one out of four letters. The A is gone, so the chance of the X, one out of three letters. Chance of the E, one out of two, and the chance of the L, one out of one. We multiply all those scenarios and we're left with one over 24 is the probability of pulling Axel out of a bag. See you next time.